your father, isn't it? <laughs> Fun indeed. It's the magician's cheap trick. Uh, that, you are, that, that was a real frog, your majesty. Of course it's a real frog. You are not mad, are you? Of course, father. How can I be mad? I'm not mad. <laughs> so am I mad? No, oh, you're not mad. <laughs> 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 well, it's very convincing. <laughs> why are you looking at me like that? Huh? Why are you looking at me like that? Well, I don't know. You tell me why. Why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> you know, I really didn't like that. That guy. Kind of <laughs> We're going to use it for soup. We're going to use it for soup. It's cool. What? You're very stupid, father. I'm going to clean the bed for My son, what has gone over you? Finished. My son, my throne. <laughs> The heir to my throne. The only blood in my line. We must not lose hope yet, Your Majesty. Did you say it all? So how can I hope against hope? Anger. Anger. See what it has cost me. Huh? If only we control what we say, we won't get angry. The messenger said that if a stranger love and care for him and show him affection, he will recover. Who will love the mad prince? Who? Advice will move him from this land first. The people cannot see this. We must move him to a distant land. Otherwise, the prince will die. No! Ikoka said no! My son can't die. Then it is wise to move him. We must act expeditiously. I fear the prince will die. <laughs> Look at me. Now you have to move him to another land immediately. Mark this land carefully. Okay? We shall keep him here. If what um, the messenger of God of anger is entering to go by, you might find true love. Love that will set him free. You, stay with him at all times. Cater to his every need. Yes, sir. Here earlier, there's been raining cats and dogs outside. So how was he? Yeah. 
I fear he's still mad, Your Majesty. But how come I'm not the one that was struck with this madness? Why my son? Huh? It's the will of the God of Thunder. He toys with you. He is toying with you, Your Majesty. Well, I have a suggestion as to how we can bring love and affection to the prince. Please tell me. We shall find a young maiden and we shall spoil her. What would that achieve? Everything. It will achieve everything. Once she gets accustomed to royalty, to luxury, she will be ready to do anything to maintain the status quo. Especially if she perceives she is to be the next queen of this land. Yes. Then we take her to the prince. She will give him all the love and affection he needs to bring him around again. Do you think that will succeed? With every measure of humility, your majesty. Have you ever doubted my abilities? No, 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 no not at all. It's just that I... I am disturbed. I want anything that can be done to restore my son's sanity. Remember, he's the heir apparent to the throne. I give him my word, Your Majesty. To be done, the prince will be whole again. Oh, okay, let's give the throne. Yes, Your Majesty. Oh, thank you for your efforts. It is my duty, Your Majesty. Morning. Auntie, did you write the letter? Yes, I did. Let me bring it. Okay. Oh. Please give it to her. I shall win. Thank you. On, on my way to this place, I, I saw a madman. I think he's new in town. Who knows what he did? Maybe he brought the cause of himself. Please no. greet my daughter Edna for me and give it to her. I shall win. I shall win. How long will you stay with her? Ah. Auntie, I'm not coming back this time if I don't get a job. You will get a I job. I will stay there as long as I can, so far as I get a job. Don't worry, you'll we'll get a job. Okay. Eh? Self journey. Right, Be careful though. I sure will. Mad nobody. Just save my soul. How? How can I save your soul? Come. Come, I'll show you. I should come? Yes. Whisper. Whisper? Yes. Come down.
Princess! Save me! Save me! Save me! You beautiful <coughs> Jesus. Jesus. What kind of a dream was that? do to you or what did you do to her? Nothing. She seems to be dissatisfied with everything I do. Nothing I do satisfies her. I don't understand. Well, it's okay. I'm here, okay? I'll talk to her when she comes back. Alright? Let me take your bag aside. Alright. Very good. Thank you very much. <laughs> So, you believed all that she told you? My sister, I saw sincerity in that girl. She is our cousin. Mm. Charles, Edna is a very stubborn girl. And she needs an iron hand to bend her. Don't forget, she's a big girl. And she needs to be treated as such. Mm. Yeah. Anyway. Let's forget Edna and her problems for now. How long are you going to stay with us? Well, for now I don't know. Because I need to submit my CV at some companies and I'll stay and wait for their feedback. That's okay. Edna! Auntie? Come and buy a drink for my brother. Mm -hmm. You know my brand now? What? Beer, I don't take soft anymore. Where in this house? I'm a big boy. Not for your life, you know that stuff. You'll be your big boy when you go out, not here. Okay. You fast like that. So. Um, Jesus, I can't just. This girl is such a nice girl. How is the village? How is the auntie? Mother and everybody. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, fine. Oh, okay. Um. Oh, you're back. <laughs> Come on! You see why I always speak and cuss? It's okay. Yeah? It's alright. It's okay. Let me 
Sorry. You don't know how to make money, let alone know how to buy things. Get out of my sight! See, what you just did now is uncalled for. It's a simple mistake, and, and, and you can see it was intentional. As you can see, I don't have your time now, neither do I have hers. If you want, take your drink. If you don't want, don't. It's not intentional. Feel your excuse. I don't know what I did to her think she, she hates me so much. Come on, don't talk like that. Nobody hates you. Huh? In fact, even if the whole world hates you, I don't hate you. And that is why I'm here to protect you. Okay? I'll help you with your studies, okay? Thank you. Well, Eddie, uh, on my way back, I bought you some things. I bought you something chips and final orange. Because I cannot accept it. And this is if I begin to eat things like this, I'll begin to steal all my groovings. What okay, well, was that supposed to mean? I heard that person take it. I rather keep taking it. What was that supposed to mean? It started with Uncle Mike. Not too big to be writing down. Don't mind her looks. Her looks is deceptive. She's only 20. Even at that, she'll be in her third or final year. Well, she's been staying in the village before. She just came in two months ago to stay there. I see. Well, you are here to know my house, not to talk about my sweet cousin. So, what do I have for you? I start with you. Well, I don't have one at home, but Edna will go and buy. Edna! Edna! Go and buy a bottle of stock. Like this. Let me see. Okay. You now know my house. She's not around, but she said you should wait for her that she'll send you back. Okay. Yes, sir. You can go up and wait. Let me go and buy bread. Why we'll not to come up and keep me company? No, sir. My auntie might not like that. She won't mind. Just come up and keep me company. I'm supposed to buy bread first. Let me buy it and come back. Uh -huh. You want to go to the university? Yes. When you get the admission, just let me know so I'll give you some money. No, my auntie's going to pay my school fees. Yes, I know. Some... I know. Are you going to pay your auntie's friend? Can she take care of you? Besides, you look big for you're a small girl. I'm not a small girl. I'm a big girl. Mm. I'm going to be 21 this year. Come, let me see how tall you are. Okay. okay. <laughs> wait, wait, stop. No, wait. No. Wait, wait, wait. No, I'm not small. No. Anna! Hey. What the hell is going on? I was going to buy bread before before he came. Hey, Michael. 
What is going on here? Okay, I'll just ask you that if you What I saw now, is it an imaginary thing or what I am feeling? You were asking her if I was around. So this is how you came to marry me, the so-called marriage thing that you're talking about. Oh, but thank God, I saw it coming. Now, get out of this company. I was out. I said, 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 I was out. I was out. I said, 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 I was out. I Come on, baby. I've bought this for you, okay? You take it. Have it now. Have it. Take it. It's good for your health. Mm -hmm. hmm? Alright. Enjoy yourself, okay? I didn't see your own there. Mine is in the kitchen now, in there. Why? I think you said I must never eat on the dining table. Oh, oh come on. No, forget about my sister. You see, these few days that she won't be around, you've got to exercise your freedom in this house, okay? Uh huh. So it's your freedom. Why are you looking at me like that? Oh, oh uh, I'm just trying to you know, admire a wonderful creature of God, which you are, you know. <laughs> thank you. You don't need to thank me. Come on, you don't need to. In fact, wait until you enter university. You start with simple forms, wearing all those skimpy, <laughs> you know, clothes and skin and all that. That's when you begin to understand and appreciate how beautiful you are because they will be like, they will fall in line. Hello, hello, girl. Hello. <laughs> But I won't have money to do all that. Why am I striving to get a job? Because if I get a job, I'll be paid well. And when I'm paid well, trust me, I'll provide you with all those things. I'll pay them for you. Honestly, that means I'll start praying for you. Need that prayers, honestly. And you need to study hard so you can pass your job and get admission. Hmm? Thank you. I'm happy you're living with us. You're nice. Person too, you good girl. I mean, you're a wonderful person. I mean, you're a special person, you know. <laughs> Come over to the dining room, we're gonna eat together. See, I'm gonna teach you some table manners, some etiquette, you know, like a fucking knife, how to handle. I know you know you used to cut Larry's. Just come over there, okay? I'm waiting there. <laughs> Correctly, okay. you end yourself one biscuit. Okay, huh? two, one. Okay, I'll, yeah. I'll give you two. Don't worry, I'll give you two. I'll give you two. It's okay. Um, who was the first president of Nigeria? The Gunam you, you are correct, baby. <laughs> <laughs> You're correct. Take. Okay. And um, the second question. Name four major cities in Nigeria. Lagos. Mm-hmm. Kanu. Mm-hmm. Um, Ibadan. Um, Lagos, Kanu, Ibadan. Um, you are very, very intelligent girl. Very intelligent. The biscuit. Okay, 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 that's true. Mm -hmm. 
Name the three major ethnic groups in Nigeria. That's the easiest. Excuse me? Mm-hmm. Uh, Igbo, Hausa, and Yoruba. Oh, Jesus. I wouldn't have <laughs> See, you are very, very intelligent. That's bravo. That's good. Okay? <laughs> Which one do you want? Biscuit or juice? Me too. <laughs> the crazy amount. <laughs> I think. And the juice. I said a sim. Hi. What is it? There's something in my back when you touch me. How do you mean? <laughs> like this? <laughs> You're feeling something, right? Mm -hmm. Like chemistry or something. <laughs> but you don't understand. Uh, with time, you'll get to understand. So, uh, the next question is uh, There's no be scared of me. I'm your uncle. Come on. <laughs> Relax. Hey. Uh, next question. Let me, please. Huh? You want to? Yes. to my throne. Ikoku, father, my favorite cousin. How are you? Very well, your friends. Sit down. The most gracious, your friends. So, with your highness permission, the expeditiousness of this situation cannot the facade, your highness, as they say, we must call a meeting of all the elders. We we'll sit with them on a round table. You curse him! Um, if I may, your highness, that appears to be the mark of the god of anger. Curse to the god of anger and you for giving me water with insect to drink. Your head will be chopped off. God! Yes, your highness. Sorry, your highness. Your highness, I'm sorry. Hey, wait. wait. You go. Your highness, sorry. Your highness, please. Your highness. People, I'm sorry. <laughs> Father, 
that was a harsh decision you took on that maid. My beloved son, one day you will make king. And if you're not firm over small matters, then great matters will swallow you. But father, to be head because of a fly? How is Coco? Okay. Yes. My prince. How is the community water project going? It's going quite well, Your Majesty. I hope you know we are commissioned next week. You have no cause to fear. We will be there along the first game. Mm -hmm. Your one. Highness, you have a visitor. From where? He wouldn't say, Your Highness. He said it concerns the future of the throne. I, I will advise you soon, Your Majesty. You can go ask you Messenger from the God of Honor. What brings you here? Your sin. Because the God of Honor never brought me here to curse you. What rubbish are you talking about? Huh? I am king! And I can curse whoever I want to curse. And my beloved son here, when he becomes king, he also can curse anybody. Pride. 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 From this moment, your son will be struck with madness. He must leave this kingdom to another kingdom. And only affection and love from a stranger will set him free. And you think I will sit down here and listen to you? Talk this nonsense in my, my palace? God! Yes, your highness. Behead him! Affection and love from a stranger is set him free. He must leave this kingdom immediately, or else he dies. The fact that we relate well in the night is not a guarantee for you to insult me. I'm your elder. What are we eating this morning? I don't know. There's no food. Okay. If you don't know, that means there's no food in the house. I will start by eating you. No, no! Ah! Ah! Oh, no, no! Oh, no, no! Ah! Ah! No! Ah! Oh, no! Ah! Ah! No!
You're back. Yeah, yeah I'm fine. How are the people in the village? Everybody's fine. Yeah. So how is Edna? Yeah. Yeah, she's upstairs. Okay. Edna! I don't know what's wrong with that girl. I mean, for some time she has been acting for me. Did you do anything to her? Why would I do anything? Nothing. Why would I do anything to her? Nothing. Okay, let's go find out. Edna! 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 Come, you need to hear my voice. And what the hell are you doing? I'm packing my things. For what? I'm going back to the village. Oh my god. Are you out of your senses or something? You want to go back to the village to trouble your poor mother? It's better than seeing you. Uh, I know me too well. You are not going anywhere. Now, go to the parlor and unpack the things I came back with. And I mean now! Rubbish. I want to go there. Let me wait for you. Let me go. Edna! Edna! Auntie, take this moment. Somebody is coming to fill the water tank later in the day. Pay him and keep my balance for me. The soup in the pot is for you, Charles. You should manage it. I just... 
Oh, this stupid girl did not live with my boy. I don't care whether she went back to the village or not. My lord, that is my business. Hello? Yes. Speaking. He's my brother. Where? How? God, this is the madman I've been seeing in my dreams. What is the problem? No, I can't stay with them anymore. Them? Please come, come and talk to your mother. Come and tell me what the problem is. That's how it happened. Oh, I'm finished. I am finished. What did you say Charles did to you? Your own cousin. Who else have you told? No one else. Please, we'll keep it this way. Nobody should hear this. This is an abomination. Let me see Charles. I'll kill him personally. Don't worry. Tomorrow I will take you to the village clinic for a medical checkup. And as long as I live, you'll not leave my side again to go and stay with anybody. Never. By the way, have you taken the jam? I'll write it next month. Don't worry, you write the jam from here. You go from here to write it. What sort of abomination is this? Your own cousin. Is it because of her poverty? I'm a because of money! <laughs> Just your own cousin. How big a waro? It's an abomination. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> hey. Oh, bro, they're all related. Says you are okay. Hey, thank God. I thank God. Hey, Mama, thank God. So you're here. Where do you want her to be? Where do you want her to be? So you took my daughter to the city to useless her life, Ewa. What did she tell you? Ah, what's it good about you or her stay with you? By the way, where is Charles, your brother? <sighs> Just had an accident. Please God. Huh? 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 
Charles is dead. No. Charles is dead. Is <laughs> dead. Hey. He says found him out. He says found him out. Gaji, do you know that right under your roof, Charles was sleeping with my daughter? It's a lie. And I tell it's not true. How would you know, Gaji? Did you make this up, Edna? Oh, my God. How would you know? When you were busy, you were treating her. Treating her like a slave, my own daughter. But it's over. It's over. As of Charles, my Bible says that the wages of sin is death. Serve him right. Mama, this man now, I've been meaning to ask. The madman that's along the road, who is he? Edna, I don't know. He appeared there one morning. Rumors have it that a certain man always comes there to feed him. Mama, yes, man. While I was living at Atinkechi's house, I always see that madman in my dream. Hey, yes. The madman in your dream? Yes, Mama. He yeah. always appeared in my dream crying and asking me to save him, to help him. Yeah. So on my way home, when I saw him there, I was shocked. I was shocked because that is the exact position I always see him in my dream. Hey, sounds strange. Very strange, Mama. Very Very strange. Man in your dream? But I'm certain. He is the madman I saw in my dream all the time. This is strange. Very strange.
I see you in my dreams. I think you're trying to tell me something. What could it be? How could I possibly help you? I'm just a poor girl living with my mother. I know somebody gave birth to you. I know this madness is not your fault. I guess. Maybe that's why I see you in my dreams. have any money on me. The only money we had, I spent it on your medical test. Hmm? I'm going to have to eat only white yam. Eat only white yam? We won't steal, Mama. Would we? <sighs> okay, just boil the yam. Let me get oil from our days. Oh. Mama, what happened to our palm trees? The palm trees are there. They are not yet ripe. Just cook the yam. Let me go and borrow oil. Huh? Oh, no. Oh, well. Come I know you used to eat better meals at the city. Mama, I think the Bible says it is better for one to go to where you are loved than eat vegetable, than to eat abundant meat where you are not loved. This is my home, and I'm proud of it. But Edna, how are you going to go to the university? Hmm? You need money to pay for the school fees. The God that has been taking care of us ever since Papa Kelechi died will certainly come to our aid. I trust that. 
it for me, Felicia, and your father. It's a lot. You won't be going through this house. Mama, please. Don't be sad. Look at me. I promise. I promise you, Mama, I'm going to make you really proud. I'll wipe poverty away from this family. I promise. Please eat. Eat, Mama. I brought you food because I saw you in my dream again. You said you were hungry. That's why I brought you food. You want to eat, right? Right? I wish you could talk to me. I wish you could tell me how to help you. I'm a sad girl too, you know. I have no one. No one to stand for me. No one to pay my school fees. None that I know of. Except my mother. Except my mother. Except my father. Except my mother.
look at weeds everywhere. Eh? How do I start within the whole place? Hey. Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon, my daughter. How's your mother? She's very fine. You are saying something about the weeds? Yes, my daughter. The weeds are quite much. Eh? And I don't have an atom of strength to weed them. Not to worry, ma. I can help you with them. Can you? Yes, ma. Hey. I was even thinking to employ somebody to do the weddings. Oh you. no. Where can you start? Tomorrow I'll start cooking. Okay. <laughs> you come over to my house and collect two. Don't worry, ma. We have two holes in my house. I'll use one. That's kind of you. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. I'm waiting for you tomorrow, huh? Hey! God always remember his people. Eh? Look at the humble girl rescuing me. Okay. Oh. Good morning, my daughter. How are you? Fine, thank you, ma'am. Come, 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 come. You did a very wonderful job on my farm. Hmm? Thank you, ma'am. That's good of you. Thank you, ma'am. Have this. No, ma'am. I still have it from the bottom of my heart. Take it. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you very much. Ah, Abako, I heard your voice. Ah, yes, Cecilia. Your daughter weeded my farm, and I came to show appreciation. How are you? I'm fine. Only that um, I need a house help. The one I had ran away last month. And you haven't found another person? No, I haven't. Nobody wants to do that type of work again. Uh, yeah. 
Thank you very much, Ma. I beg to take my leave, huh? It's have a nice day. Ma, we go see you. Bye bye. Two thousand naira. Why did you do it? We need to survive. That's why I did it. It shall be well with you, man. Whatever you do in life, my blessing will follow you. Amen. Amen. Let me go to the market with this money to buy some foodstuffs. Thank you, <laughs> Mama. Thank you. <laughs> am I hearing? The daughter of Let Mazobiga. Oh, my daughter. You are, you are welcome. <laughs> Good morning, sir. Uh, my daughter, how may I help you? Oh, there's no problem, ma'am. Yesterday you said you didn't have a house help and you needed a hand. So I came to see if there's anything I can do for you. That thought's full of you. Um, we need water. At the same time, clothes to be washed. No problem, ma'am. Let me start with the water first. Where's the bucket? You go inside. Take your left. Huh? You'll see bucket there. Okay. Thank you. Good. Hey. God bless you, my daughter. And rest, oh, rest a while before washing. No, ma, I'm okay. I'm young and strong. I can wash the clothes before I go home. Okay, if you insist, let me do it for you. Okay. Is this all? Just water. Thank you. Let me bring the other one. Thank you, ma. Okay. I'm sure, ma. You are true. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I want to go and prepare lunch. Thank you. My regards to your mom. Yes, God bye bless bye. you. Bye bye. <laughs> of the daughter of the late Marze Obiga. Yes, sir. How are you, my daughter? I'm fine, sir. How is your mother? She went to the market. Does she still sell vegetables at the market? Yes, sir. Oh, I remember those days when we were young. I used to hunt lizards with your late father. Ms. Obiga. My husband. She says she wants to clean all the dirty utensils in the kitchen. That's okay. Cleanness is next to godliness. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, yes, yes. Give it to her. She's been good.
I'm true, ma. Uh, you are true? Yes, ma. So be. Yes, ma. Thanks a lot, my daughter. No problem, sir. I should take my leave now. Mm. My daughter, take this. It's just a token. Have it. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, sir. Edna. Sir. Continue to be a good girl. I promise, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Greet your mother for me. Sir, yeah, and you. Thank you, ma'am. I've never seen such a humble and hard-working girl. The girl is too good. I wish I can see her with my eyes. I don't worry. It will be alright. Hmm? Now, do you know that I was unable to sell anything today? Hmm? Why? Look at the vegetables, they are decaying. I wonder where I'm going to get the money to pay my supplier. You know that I buy on credit and pay after sales. Where am I going to get the money now? How much are you owing them? $750. Take this money. What is it? Ah, where did you get this kind of money? Huh? Your dad could give it to me for cleaning her house, washing clothes, and washing all the plates in the house. Even <laughs> May I live to see your children? Huh? God, God bless you. you. God bless you. Yeah. I'm walking. What am I walking here? God bless you. Yeah. What could I have done without you? Stop crying. Now you have money. Oh, thank you. Thank you, my love. So what are we going to do with all this? We can throw it away. <laughs> God bless you. Amen. What could I have done with that, my daughter? Hmm? This boy. God bless you. Yeah? Hey. It's naked. Happy today. Madam, business was very good today. Thank you. Oh. That money you brought helped me to buy fresh vegetables. So I have to profit. Too much money. Something is too much for you. Like this is. Nothing. I bought clothes for you. Nothing. 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 I bought clothes for you. You bought me clothes. You like it? I like it very much. I sold everything. Can't see the tray is empty. It's for you. You're the best mother in the world. You're a good girl. You're a good girl. So that's why I have to buy it. I can't go to there. I sold everything. So I have to buy something for you. Hey! <laughs> ah, Mama, thank you. It's okay. Let me get these things inside and try them. It's okay. Hey! Thank you, Mama. Thank you. Ah, you want to go back to drink? Yes. Thank you. Good. Thank you, Lord. I want my daughter to be happy like this always. And I want to be happy too. Good business. Thank you, Lord. Ikoku. I'm the chief advisor to the king. Oh, I didn't know. Oh, sorry. Of course you didn't. 
Um, it's not written on our forehead. <laughs> what is your name? My name is Ama. Ama. Beautiful name. And who is your father? Erika, the farmer. Where is your father at this moment? He's gone to the farm. Where's your farm? If you go this way, go down there. Oh, wonderful. To the left? Eh? Yes. Good. Um, I shall go and find your father. Mm, okay. May I go now? Oh, of course, my lady. Have a most pleasing day. Are you serious? Of course. I want to train her to be the next queen of this land. But why us? Why the poor family of Areka, the farmer? Even cats may look at the king. How much more humans? What can I say? The girls choose whom to lift. It is not my choice. In that case, I will discuss it with my family. Of course. Um, let me let you enjoy your manual labor. Bye bye, yo. Madman. I don't know, but maybe that is how the gods want to lift us up. Mm -hmm. Papa, you saw me when I was going on an errand mm -hmm. for mother this morning. Eh? Ada, mm -hmm. I think he liked what he saw. Mm -hmm. As a king's advisor and for what he said, you look perfect from what they want in a wife for the prince. Mm -hmm. But they hardly know me. They don't even know my character. No. Don't mind, my daughter. They will train you in the ways of the king. They will train you. Yeah. I have mixed feelings about this whole thing, my daughter. Who knows? Maybe that maybe the girls have chosen to work out of poverty. So, you advise I should go? I have no option, my daughter. The king wants you for the son. Though my only reason for agreeing is that they want to train you. That's all. You can always come back to us if you're not comfortable with the whole arrangement. Hmm? You won't be comfortable in the king's palace. Everybody will. Amarachi! Hey! Your Majesty. May I present King Mazuzu I of Mazuzu Kingdom. Behold, 
chosen one for the prince. Turn this one. But how come she is apparently so plain? That can be explained, Your Majesty. She came straight from her father's home into the palace. And who is her father? Erica, the father. Oh, the cat may look at the king. Young lady, you're welcome. Thank you. But make sure that the next time she's appearing before me, she looks more royal. Very well, Your Majesty. Young lady, apparently you have found favor before my king. Thank you, Your Highness. This is a good thing. The sweet peas. I'd like to introduce you to our mom. She is the future queen of our land. The new bride for the prince. This is the chief lady. Her name is Ulama. She's explicitly groomed and trained in the art of cooking, of grooming, and taking care of the palace. You will be her new charge. She will teach you how to walk, speak, and look like a princess. Let me have a word with you. Excuse me, my dear. My dear, I cannot overemphasize the importance of the situation. The king stated that there should be utmost secrecy. If anybody wants to know about the whereabouts of the prince, simply tell them that um, he's been taken to a distant land for grooming to be king. Do I make myself clear? Yes, sir. Now, in the event this pact is violated or jeopardized in any form, I'm sure you understand the repercussions. Yes, sir. The person's head will be chopped off. I'm glad you knew that. Now, we don't want to lose your pretty head very soon, do we? Yes. No, then we understand each other. Yes. Come. My dear, you will go with her. Turn her into a princess of the land. Polishing the beads I gave you. No. I want to take a little nap. Will you get up and go and do the work I assigned to you? Who's this? The prince is bride to be. You can't be serious. It's the king's choice, and we have work to do. You're welcome. I'm evil. My name is Emma. Did you hear what I said? She will be the next queen. You're welcome. Excuse me. This is the maid's quarters. For now, only Evo and I are here. Where are the rest? Beheaded by the king's orders. I thought it were all rumors. No, they're not. Ever since the queen died, the king has been a bit temperamental. Your regalia will be here in a few days. And we need to fix your hair very fast. Come, let me take you to your room. This will be your room. I can't believe my good fortune. Your position is every girl's dream. Tell me, what do you think I need to deserve all of this? Destiny. 
Wishes of the gods. Let me get you some clean clothes while you fix your regalia. You'll be taught how to carry yourself in the presence of the king and the prince. When I get to meet the prince? Not now. Besides, he's not in the palace for now. So where is he? Somewhere secret. Where he's being taught to be a king. That sounds strange. I'm teaching you how to be a princess. Okay, because I was up on his royal hood and the prince. Do not ask too many questions. Okay. Let me get you some clean clothes. Rest your bones.
How's that, my cooking? She's doing great, sir. I'm sure you still recall the whole essence of this exercise, eh? Yes, sir. The prince becomes well if she loves and appreciates him. I will see to it that you are adequately rewarded from the king himself. How far have you gone with your arrangement? We're in advanced stages now, Your Majesty. We're preparing her mentally as well as physically. Any news yet about my son? I'm afraid the prince is still mad. Honestly, whatever can be done to restore his sanity, please do it fast. Everything that's supposed to be done, it's been done. She'll be ready soon and we'll take her to meet him. She'll give him all the love and affection he requires. And the spell will be broken. I give you my word, the prince will be whole again. Is there no picture of the prince in this palace? Because I've not seen one anywhere. Why do you want to see a picture of the prince? To know whom and be prepared for. I mean, is it tall, short, or crippled? What will that change? A lot. It will change a lot. I will have a picture of him in my mind while I wait to meet him. You don't need it for now. I insist, as a prince's wife to be, I want a picture of him. Is that right? Yes, Your Majesty. Good. My prince, I brought something for you. You requested for something, Amma. What? The prince's picture. Here it is. Thank you so much. See you later. What was that for? Did you have to bring the pictures to her now? She requested for it and she needs to know what the prince looks like. Oh, what the prince looks like! Caution, evil. Or you will have your head chopped off by the king's order.
Come here, my love. Then look into my eyes and tell me that you love me. You are my world. dreaming about? The prince, of course. He's so handsome. So, do you think you can fall in love with him? I've already fallen for him. With his picture. <laughs> Come My on. spirit will come him. Come on, don't be social. I know what I feel right now. I do. Come on. Amma, there are also people in this palace to admire you. Like who? I, for one. You're fast becoming my good friend. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So, do you like me? Of course. So tender and caring. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks for saying that. The prince is so handsome. Tell me, is he more caring and romantic like he looks? He chops off head to <laughs> the king. <laughs> Can you say that? Oh well. Oh. He he's more understanding than the king. Yeah. He looks so loving. Caring. So romantic. Looks almost perfect without blemish. You know, what I've been dreaming about my dream man. Koko, any news of the prince so far? The prince is still mad. So don't you think it's time to move in for the kill? I do not think so. I think we should treat with a great deal of caution. For I know, as long as I am Koko, the advisor to the king will sit on that throne. The Prince Martin, this is a very important opportunity we should embrace. I agree. But I still insist that we tread carefully, with caution. The king is no fool, you know. And I don't have to overemphasize the consequences of what will happen if the king discovers what we're plotting. Ah! If you get to know that, our head will be chopped off. I'm glad you understand the uh, consequences, gentlemen. 
So, what about the girl? The beautiful damsel. <laughs> <laughs> yes. What about her? I might at the end, my friend, kill two birds with one stone. She is going to get a shock of her life. Okay. Ikoko, hey, yes. what's the plot like? The plot is simple, really. She has all the mannerisms, mm -hmm. all the looks of a princess. Of a queen to be. I will shock her. For she will get used to royalty. Embrace it. And then when pride sets in, she will find it very difficult to go back to her old background of poverty. Exactly. Ikuku. She's for the prince. She will get the shock of her life when she discovers the truth. Look, don't underestimate women. She must love him. Patience. For it is not over yet. Hmm? It's okay. Let <laughs> us um, drink. Ego. <laughs> The king, <laughs> the king to be <laughs> by <laughs> Why is it that we're in the same palace? And yet I've only set my eyes on the king once. Because he's king. Secondly, he'll call you when the time is right. Give me my room. She's becoming very confident. Yeah, it's where you want to be. She's the queen to be. <laughs> That's if the prince gets back his senses. If he doesn't, he'll become his royal madness. Let me see the queen to be. The wind of change. No the the wind of change. Things being equal, I might be the next queen. Yes, I know. How long have you been into it? Into what? Nice Beyonce. Please answer me. You kissed me the other day. Yes. I've wanted you ever since I set my eyes on you. So. How long have you been into it? Since I was 14. My neighbor influenced me into it. I might have your head chopped off. Why? I want you around me ever. But if you dream of touching me ever again, I might have you executed. Do you understand? Yes, I do. Good. Nobody will hear about what transpired between us. Belong to the prince, and I can't wait to be with him. You can go. Change. Oh, I love the 
from Manchester. Ikoku, is the girl ready? I'll go and check. Ikoku, please. Do your best. I, I miss my son. Please. Yes, sir. Ikoku. Yes, your majesty. You have been very loyal to me. I appreciate that. You're my uncle, your majesty. Your family, I have no choice. I must reward you very handsomely if I join my ancestors. It is not reward I seek, your majesty. But to merely find um, a favor in your eyes. You're like a father to me. He took me in when nobody would. I must go now. The prince will be whole again. Only love the vibe. Your Majesty, King Mazuzu, may I present the bride to be for the prince? You need transformed into a beautiful and sophisticated girl. Thank you, Your Highness. I hope you understand what awaits you. Yes, Your Highness. Ikoku, you've done a great job. Your reward, a hundred plots of land near my choicest estate. Now yours. You're most generous, Your Majesty. Now prepare the damsel to meet the prince. It is time, Your Highness. Come, have a go. Your Highness. My prince, soon your troubles will be over. The prophecy of the God of Anger would soon come true. Thank the both of you for all you've done for me. You've transformed a village girl into a royal princess. My promise to the both of you is when I become the prince's wife, I will never forget you. And I'll make sure Two new mates join you to ease the work stress. And I'm going to meet the prince tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yes. What time? The cook is keeping it secret. <laughs> anyway, I'm so happy that at last I'm going to meet my handsome prince. Come on, be happy for me. <laughs> this is where the king advisor lives. Well, it looks okay. I know it looks okay. And that is why I think I need a bigger place. We live tonight to see the prince. Today? Yes. Where? This time, land. I want you to come with us. Will the king approve? Can't we leave now? I can't wait to see my prince charming. That is the whole essence of the exercise. So you can see your prince charming. Make preparation. We live tonight. We're here. How? Is this a joke? All the prince needs is your love and affection. Why is the prince living here? Well, this is the only place we can find them. Hey, be careful. Ah! 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 
Ikoku. Huh? Hmm? Who is this? Well, allow me to make the introduction, my lady. This is the Prince of Mazuzu Kingdom. Prince, you're bright to be. <laughs> Please come, let no, me you. No! No! Come back here! No. I said come back here! <laughs> Don't you want love? I thought love is blind, eh? <laughs> what happened to your love? <laughs> oh, now you want to achieve me. <laughs> it's looking better with it, doesn't it? <laughs> Take this loser back. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the girls are good. <laughs> Come. Um, she left her um, slippers in the wake of her distress. I didn't know you were such a fast runner, my queen. <laughs> Fuck me, go. I promised the project was going to work. Make her love him. I did everything conceivable. Everything humanly possible. She says she cannot love a madman. Prince or no prince. That can be true. No, it can't be true. It can't be true. Who will ascend the throne when I'm gone? I have no answers to that question. They wanted you to marry a mad prince. Like I told you, mother, the girl should hear about this. If the king finds out, our head will be chopped off. She's right. We must keep Alice sealed over this issue. I'm alright to my daughter. <laughs> Life in the palace has been good to you. Look at how you just added weight. The seven there. But you can't afford to marry a mad man. My daughter will not marry a madman. Oh. Yes, my daughter. Once again, you are welcome. You can go and have your sleep. Good night. Oh, my God. Adam. <laughs>
Amarachi, have your place there in the palace made this out. Look at the way you're panning that food, Leslie. Mama, I, 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 I may not be, uh, be able to cope with this suffering. Huh? You've tested food like this one. Of course, Mama. There's a difference between wealth and poverty. Then go back and marry the mattress. Go I back and marry the mattress. Where is she going to? Come on, come back. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? I'm tired. Pound it if I'm pounding my foot. The king and take over the throne. It is clear to everyone that the king has no successor. Exactly. I think we should wait, Gentle. If the king dies, I'm the next in line to sit on the throne. Of course, you are correct. But when will that be? That old fool has cheated there so many times. Exactly. I want to taste power now that I'm still young. I left a file on the back seat. Bring it to me. Fine. That's what I said, dummy. I just gave it to my boy. Welcome, my daughter. Please, go to the farm and bring the basket of yam I left under the uh, banana tree. Come on, go to where I sent you. Look, let, let me knock you with this stick now. 
don't even know the reason why she's wearing this royal dress again. What is your problem? Uh, uh, Father, I, I can't continue to, 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 to live like this after I've tasted good life. What do you want us to do? Father, I don't know. I, 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 I don't know, but I, I, I've tested you out. I, I'm coming back to this again. I'm actually working with you. I hope why are you acting like the non corner turn out. of a thing is what take giving you madness so oh, oh, careful you I, I want to you don't go and marry the mad please you're free I will enough is enough of it oh, let me drink water and drop cup for you this this girl Going inside. Going inside. Yes, go inside. Go inside. I'm allergic. Leave, leave that. Leave that. Uh-uh. Just don't. They want to inherit the king's palace. To come to and that is why she will marry a madman. Huh? Yeah. So you people are living the food for me now. This is too much. The king and take over the job. It is plain to everyone that the king has no successor. Exactly. That old fool has cheated them so many times. I want to take power now that I'm still young. My name is Ikoko. I'm the chief advisor to the king. Oh, I didn't know. Oh, sorry. Of course you didn't. Um, it's not written on our foreheads. What is your name? My name is Ama. There is no secret under the sun. For whatever a man does, we must surely pay for. It may take some time, but up there we surely come. No matter who you are, this is the truth. Cause the sea will find you. No matter the distance, no matter the time. So your seas will reach you. No matter the distance, no matter the time. There's a wind of change. There's a wind of change Sweeping across the There's a wind of change Nice to see Ah! Mama! I saw the king The king is here Don't worry about the seats, what I have to say is very good my dear, let me, let me see. Okay. I suppose you're not happy here, hmm? To tell me the truth, I am not. I can't stand this poverty anymore. Mm, thought as much. I think I have a solution for that. Hmm? Mm. Meet me in my house tomorrow. Ah, uh, Mama. I'm afraid I must run along now. I hope all is well. No, all is well. 
It's just that the king wants to converse with his future daughter-in-law. In Malagasy? Absolutely, absolutely. My dear, goodbye. goodbye. Tomorrow, eh? Why do you think what you see me? Don't know, tomorrow. I'll find out. What's up on this way? So, um, is this the life you want? Yes. But I can't bring myself to marry a mad prince. No. Oh, no one expects you to. But someone else is interested in you. Who? Oh. I am. You? <laughs> Why? Because I think you'll make a great queen. But I told you I won't marry a madman. Prince or no prince. I won't. But you want to live in comfort. Of course I do. The king will die soon. And the throne will be vacant. No one expects um, a mad king to ascend the throne. So naturally, I'll be the next. I'll make you my wife, my queen. Me? <laughs> what about my parents? We'll leave them out of the picture for now. You can come and live with me. We'll tell them it's the king's wish. Or better yet, we could tell them that you're still in the palace. Yeah, that's a good idea, you know. Yeah, I like it. It's cool. Find out, brings. Mike. Mike. Okay. Which Mike? The son of late Justice Okoye. Justice Okoye. Oh. <laughs> My son, you are welcome. Thank you, sir. How is your wife? No, they are all fine. They are all fine. Actually, I will move back from your house. And uh, there was nobody at home. So, I actually brought this drink. A big one. Thank you, my friend. Yes, In fact, I came to seek for your support and prayers concerning my political ambitions. Are you now a politician, my son? <laughs> yes, Papa. I'm a politician. I, I I want to represent our people and the House of Representatives in the next political dispensation, which will be coming up eight months from now. And um, as a part, uh, once ex-local government chairman in our local government, I'm here to pay homage and seek his prayers and support. You've done well, my son. Thank you, sir. You've done well. Thank you, sir. This, your voice, reminds me of the good old days before I quit politics because of my bad eyesight, which resulted to blindness. Uh, what are your plans? See, now I'm a grassroots politician, brother. So... I'm offering scholarship to 10 indigenous of this community, starting from the next academy section. Papa, I came for you to give me one candidate. That's thoughtful of you, my son. Yes, sir. But all my children are graduates living in abroad. Mm -hmm. I don't have candidates. Mm -hmm. Okay. She deserves it. Who is she? A poor girl who has been of great help to our family. A brilliant girl. And she will be writing her jam next week. Next week? That means Papa, you have a candidate then? Yes. Mama, please just tell her to get her credentials ready. Okay. But she must pass the jam. Um, Papa, I should be on my way. I should be on my way. I want to see some great men in this community. Mama, please. Add this to the drink. Help me to you to buy dried fish for Papa. Again. I know he likes it a lot. Yeah. Mm. I know. Nice. Watch it. 
Thank you. Give us a fat end. Added to the one he has given me. Yes, sir. <laughs> Thank you very hey. much, my son. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> be a good politician. Definitely. People's politician. Don't be selfish. Love your people. Thank you. But I will certainly seek to your advice, sir. Certainly. But I will be coming to see you again for more advice and support. That's all. Yes. I will always be your fellow. Huh? Okay, sir. Papa, I need to see some great men of this community. Let me just go. Okay. I will come back again, sir. Okay. Thank you, my dear. Thank you, my dear. Yes, ma'am. Johnny Mason. Yes, ma'am. I will tell Lady about this. She will be very happy. <laughs> Don't let the cat out of the bag. We must know how serious she is about her studies by passing the Jamba exam. Huh? As you wish. But uh, I'm suggesting when next Mike comes in, mm. we'll ask him to help us find one of the house help. Hence the one a a called from Europe. Couldn't help us find any. Eh? Mm. Yeah. That's okay. That's, it's, it's, it's still good. Okay. Mm. I'm ready, Mama. Oh, you're ready. It's okay. Please, if you can't come back today, hmm? go to Gichi's house. Go on. No. I'll come back today. I do not wish to go to her house. I do not know. wish to go there. I know, but in case it gets late, my daughter, I don't want anything to happen to you. It does not go get too late. late. I'll come back. It's okay. Bye -bye. Good luck, eh? Thank you. Bye-bye. Right well, no. I'll write well. My fire daughter, <laughs> God be with you. God, please bless my child for me and protect her. I appreciate she will write everything she has. Right. And bring her safely to me. Please, God, please protect her. My daughter, you are back. Yes, ma. How was the exam? It was fine. Ma. Good. As soon as the result comes out, please bring it to us. We might have something good for you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay. I'll be very grateful. Okay, my Thank daughter. you. Mm -hmm. Let me have you catch up. There's a wind of change Knowing across the land Something we can't change All of the bad doing When the man decides to wrestle the gods It's like pitching the tent in the eyes of the god There's no escape and there's no way to run Hello! I came for a friend's traditional marriage. Ah. Yes, I will be traveling to America next week. Is that so? I want there to be so much. That's good though. That's good. So, where is my little cousin, Edna? Because I brought her child. So. Did she pass? I don't look on her. Edna! Edna! My job is on the My job is on the ground. She passed. She passed. I don't know. Tell us. She passed. Yes! <laughs> Oh my god! 
About it too. I'm thinking about it. God, I've worked so hard to give up now. I've worked so hard. You go to school, my daughter. Whatever happens, you go to school. I know. But it takes money to pay school fees. Oh, no. no. If your father were alive, we won't be going through all this. We'll be going through all this.
Thank you for paying my hospital bills. God will show and reward you. Thank you. It's okay, my dear. Just remember to take your drugs always. High blood pressure is not a sickness to be joked with. And stop thinking too much. God does not forget his own people. This I know. Oh, that's what you're right. Thank you very much, Auntie. Thank you. Okay, my dear. I should be taking my leave. It's okay. Let me know. Let's take good care of her. Yeah? Okay. Okay. I wonder what we'll have done without Auntie and her husband. Mama, please, I want you to stop thinking about me. I beg you. Else you develop a heart attack. The doctor said you're close to having one already. I'll try it. I will try. I'll be okay. Mama, please. you mention anything about your jam results? Actually, Ma, I, I did pass. Mm -hmm. What's the essence of a jam result when I don't have money to pay my school fees? I thought I told you to let me know when the result comes out. You did, Ma. But you and your husband have done enough for us already. Don't be silly. Just get me your jam and Wayek results. First thing tomorrow. Do you hear that? I will, Ma. Thank you very much. Thank you. I will. That's my daughter. Thank you, Ma. Well, I'll be waiting for the reporter. I've finished sweeping the kitchen, Ma. And let me just quickly sweep outside if I go. No. You don't overstress yourself, my daughter. I'm fine, Ma. You don't overstress yourself. It's okay. Hmm? Come on. We have something for you. Have it. Read it. Take it forth and read. Open it and read. Michael Dozier Enterprises, as part of its corporate social responsibility, uses this letter to announce to you that you've been. You have gotten a five-year scholarship to any university! <laughs> It. She even deserves more than that. That girl. Hey! Thank God. Ah, I thank mm -hmm. God for her. Oh. I said, I'm going to house with the company, and the company agreed to see me through school. Five years! Five years, Mama, five years! Scholarship! Scholarship! Five years! Scholarship! Five years! Mama, five years! Scholarship! Oh my God! God, they are great! They are great! Oh my God! 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 Oh, baby. 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 O
What am I doing here? What is happening? My, my prince, look! Where's my father? Where's the Koko? It's a long story. I am sure the king will be glad to see you, my prince. I will take you to Mazuzu Kingdom right away. Heavens! Take me out of here at once, my prince. This way. Blessing goes with you. Amen. <laughs> I'll miss you. 
you know. Me too. I'll miss you, but you're leaving for a brighter tomorrow. So, God be with you. Be careful. Okay, and don't stress okay. yourself. Mm -hmm. Do go and fetch up at home. meant to keep watch over my son. That means my son will remain perpetually mad simply because a girl that's supposed to love him ran away. No, Your Highness. Your son is here. My son is here. Yes, Your Highness. Go fetch him. Yes, Your Highness. My son is here. Prince is here. After all. Yes, Father. He told me everything that happened. But let me freshen up and he'll tell us the story all over again. God! You go call me, Pope. Son, meanwhile, you go and freshen up. Uh, 
have a good shower. Yes, Father. Oh, oh, I feel so excited. I feel so excited. Uh, the prince is back. The heir to my throne is back. Helen Hardy. Oh, this call for jubilation and celebration. What do you want to do today? Mm -hmm. So she can get my beads and earrings. <laughs> yes. You want to start looking like a queen, huh? Mm-hmm. As befits a true king. Yes. And your wife to be. <laughs> the money's always been there. Spending it is a problem. Yes. Anybody home? Anybody home? Anybody home? Well, is somebody home? Why do you be making noise like that? Are you crazy? It is urgent, sir. The king wants you in his palace right now. What is the news? The prince is back. What does the madman want in the palace? He's no longer mad. Did I hear you right? And that is why you've been summoned to the palace. Come, my beloved son. Come and sit in the rightful place. Father. Loyal God, I want you to tell my father the story you told me on our way back. Uh, Prince. My beloved and loyal third cousin. This is Prince of Mazuzu land. The heir to the Mazuzu throne. I am no longer mad. Take a good look at me. I am sane now. My prince, I, I am looking. I, I, I'm, I can't believe this. This loyal guard will tell us a little tale. Your Highness, my prince, you were mad for some time. And I was assigned to keep an eye on you. To make sure you don't go astray or stab until a pearl started visiting you, my prince. I see you in my dreams. I think you're trying to tell me something. What could it be? How could I possibly help you? I'm just a poor girl living with my mother. I know somebody gave birth to you. I know this madness is not your fault. I guess. Maybe that's why I see you in my dreams.
They do. I don't know what it means. That was how it happened, my friends. It's an outrage. A complete outrage. You think we're supposed to believe stories like that? Iko could believe it. The spell had been broken by a girl who showed love and affection called my son. That's why I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> of course, Your Majesty. I'm, I'm more excited. <laughs> to see the Prince Hill and Hati. <laughs> That's all we follows. Father, I must find the girl. Yes, with every urgency I might add. We have to look for this girl. We have to search every nook and cranny of the land. Yes. <laughs> we told you to seize the opportunity, but you didn't. I must sit on the throne. To sit on the throne? <laughs> For now, it's too late. Nothing is late. It can never be late. Another opportunity will present itself. I will sit on the throne. I will seize power. Father, I need to find the girl that broke the spell. She's the reason why I'm whole again. You're right, my son. You see, anybody who stood by you while you had a mental problem is too worthy to be called your wife. Yes. Your Highness, Mrs. Amma is here. Who's Princess Amma? Oh, the girl that was trained to love you. Oh! The one that wouldn't love a mad prince. God, send her in. Yes, sir. Your Highness, my prince, Amma is here for you. I promise to love and cherish you for the rest of my life. Are you sure of that? Oh yes, my prince. I know I was stupid when I ran out on you the first time. But I promise to make it up to you. Father, what do you think? Well, it's up to you whether I feel you can handle it. You look pretty and dressed up like a princess. But there's only one thing. Sit down. If you didn't stand beside me when all hope was lost, how then are you going to be faithful to me? Oh, my prince. I swear by the gods that I'll stand by you, even if you go by the gate. <laughs> Father, a friend in need is a friend indeed. <laughs> Do you know that anybody who stands beside you when the going is good and runs away when the going is rough? is known as a fair-weather friend and should not be trusted in any circumstance whatsoever. And are you aware that it was a girl like you who stood beside me in my entire time of madness? Where were you all the while? Gone? Lost? In the wilderness? And then you pop up from nowhere out of the blues and you want to reap where you didn't sow? How are you going to explain that? God! I'm 
sorry, my prince. Yes, your highness. Take prince. her away at yes. once. Go back to your father's house in peace. I am not interested in you. I'm sorry. Please. My prince, I'm sorry. Give me a I'm so sorry, my prince. Well done, my son. Father, I must find my bride. You have my full blessing, son. What? I thought he would give me a second chance. Give me another chance. Only an insane person goes back to his vomit. To what you've rejected. Have you no pride? A beggar has no choice. And when the beggar has been fed dunk, he has a choice. I'm so sorry. I find it difficult going back to poverty. You know, I find it difficult to understand women. Why do you think I keep you here? Why? Our wedding bell is ringing around the corner. And look at you. Serious? Of course I'm serious. I'm so sorry, my prince. My name is Ikoku. I am the chief advisor to the king of Mazuzu Kingdom. This is the prince of Mazuzu Kingdom. The next in line for the throne. Welcome. Thank you, Ma. There is a madman who lives near the village shrine. Have you ever seen him? Who hasn't in this village? He appeared there one morning. But we haven't seen him for some time. Only God knows what has happened to the poor son. Your daughter used to visit him. Chineke, Edna, my daughter. Yes, ma'am. She loved him. Abomination! How can my daughter love a madman? I don't think I can do that. Oh, yes, you did, ma. Your daughter has a heart of gold. Look at me carefully. Do you see any resemblance between the madman and I? The madman was light complexion, yes? But my son, you're not mad. Obviously not. Out of something bitter comes something sweet. Ma, I am the man now. You see, the messenger of the god of anger cast this terrible spell on the prince and prophesied that he is to be taken to a distant land where only the love and affection of a complete stranger would break the spell. And your daughter gave me the love and affection. And the spell was broken. I, I don't know what I can make out of all this. I'm here to see her, Ma. Where is she? She's in the university. Which of them? Nigeria University, of course. Good. Ikoku. This is a check for two million naira. And it comes with love from my father, the king of Manzuzu Kingdom. Your daughter's good heart has thrown light on you. And as far as this kingdom exists, Ma, you shall never lack anything and neither will the generation that comes after you. Koku. Prince. Thank you very much, Ma. We'll leave now. It's a wise decision. Of course, Father, it is. She's the one that made me well. I have to find her. How do you trace her since you don't have her address? Someone on campus is giving me pictures of her. And as I'm talking to you now, every detail about her has been processed. 
I paid him well for it. Yeah, that means you pretend to be a student. Well, yes. So, when are you going to campus? Tomorrow. Okay. We have to seize this opportunity now. I agree. Now the prince is on campus, looking for love. I must strike now. Strike? What do they get? I have a plan for them. This one is for the king and each of the gods. How can you coordinate the stabbing? You will help me. Help? Each of you. You want power, don't you? Yes. My friend Abuchi here yes. has it from good authority that there's a conspiracy to take your throne from you. Eh? Where? Who? How? He has names. Eh, give, me, give me the names. They have to chop off. Well, it's um, a little complicated, Your Majesty. You see, we have reasons to believe that even your security is compromised. Right. Leave us. Ah! Ah! What? what? What's going on here? What, what, what's going on? Ah! What's going on? What is going on? You, 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 can't, you can't try this, Goku. Are you, you, you don't dare me. Are you dare dare me? Oh, you don't know the smell of death. You don't dare me, Goku! Guards! <laughs> Guards! 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 Oh! <laughs> you can't do this. You don't, don't dare me. Guards! What guards are you calling? Guards! They've all been taken care of. You think I'm a fool? I learned from the best, you old bastard. Prepare to join our ancestors. Nkoku, Nkoku, my son will get you. Your son is not man enough. For years I served you, took your scorn and your humiliation. But it's time to get my reward. The son of nobody shall be the next king of Mazuzu land. Trees at all. Clean it off from top to bottom. 
get rid of this excessive baggage. I shall sit on this throne tomorrow with my cool. Amma! <laughs> Amma! Come, my lady, I have the news. What? You are looking at the next king of Mazuzu Kingdom. How is it possible? Well, let me bring you up to the course of events. The king, or the past king rather, mm -hmm. is dead. Ah, no, I had no hands in his death whatsoever. Nature simply helped me put my love into the waiting arms okay. of our ancestors. Mm -hmm. And the king. Well, they had to be. The prince decided he wanted no part of yes. the throne. He's running around campuses looking for love as the president, as we speak. And mm -hmm. so the next person in line, naturally, is my humble self. We did it. It is wonderful. Listen, here is what we're going to do. What? Going to the house. Yes. Find the choicest one. Bring it out here. Okay, yes, sir. good. Don't come any closer. Don't! Why are you following me? 
You don't want to do that. Just I am going to do it. Come in the now. It's really not necessary. I just came to talk to you. That's what right. about what? What do you want? Why are you following me? I don't know you. Why are you following me? You it's follow me every day covering your face with a cap. Who are you? I know. I know. I'm not armed. Nothing. I'm not going to hurt you. Just put a stick down. You don't have to be armed. You're a man. Look. There's nothing in me. I'm not going to hurt you. I promise. I just need to talk to you. It's a very sensitive issue. That's why I ask. So just put a stick down. Sit from there. There's a madman in the village, your village. You can visit him. Give me a message to the Madman. My friend? Yes. My mad friend. Can I come closer now? Give me a message. That. That's enough. Sit from there. Okay. You want me to come close? I'm gonna come close. Okay. Take two steps. Two. Closer, I'm no longer mad. My books. I don't believe this. I mean, it sounds strange. It's odd. It's mysterious. It's a fairy tale. I know. It's unbelievable. But you're loving a madman is more fairy tale like, isn't it? You have no idea. You don't have the slightest comprehension what you've done to me. My life belongs to you now. Everything is a dream. What you have done and what I have to give is beyond me now. I just want to ask you. Hello. I hope I am not interrupting anybody. I came here to be is to you, but you are. She is dangerous. Who is she? My roommate. Fortunately. <laughs> she 
doesn't seem to like you. She's a problem to me. How? Her boyfriend broke up with her and wanted to date me. But Maureen doesn't seem to understand. I could never do a thing like that. I could never ever do a thing like that. She's a man's snatcher. Don't mind the hell nonsense to me. That's not what she told me. I don't know how she succeeded in charming you. But all I know is that that girl is evil. Evil or no evil, Edna means a lot to me. Sorry. And I can lay my life down for her. And I don't want you to ever trouble her again. Who the hell are you? Who the hell are you to tell me not to trouble her? Huh? Mr. Ku. The way I said it just went. I can lay my life down for her. So you're warned. Fuck you. You hear me out? Fuck you! I said fuck you! I'm talking to you and you're reading your book. I have told you times without number. A maker came after me. I told him I wasn't interested. If you're losing your boyfriend because of your bad attitude, then that is your hard luck. Who are you? Who are you? <laughs> This is bad. Where was she? I don't know. You can't be here anymore. Why don't you move to my hotel? I, I can't. I can't. This hostel was paid for me by a company for scholarship. I can't leave it for another student. I can't. I, I won't. I will not. Okay, okay, fine. I'll fix the problem. Here, take this. I, I don't know how much it is, but just get some clothes and whatever you want to do. Where are you going? I'm going to see Maureen. Your enemy is my enemy, remember? Mind your own business. Edna is my business and I'm minding her now. I said, what happened? And so, you're minding her. Maureen, I warned you earlier. 
I said, keep your hands off her because she means so much to me. You will not understand. She will, of course, not. Come, Chris. See, hey, don't touch me, oh. don't touch me. Oh. If you ever place your hands on her again, I swear I'll kill you. Me, 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 you're touching me. You're crazy. I said, you're crazy. You're touching me. I will show you. I will show you. You're touching me. And I will show you how crazy I am if you do that again. Don't touch me again now. You're crazy. I will show you. I will finish you off. Okay, you are going. Come back and fight me now. Don't touch me. Let me box you now. You're crazy. You're crazy, busy body. Don't touch me. I will deal with you. Don't worry. Okay, you will see. Drive! Who are you? Move it! What is this about? You will get to know when you get to our destination. Till I okay, say so. Amadi, did he give you any problem? No. When Amadi shows his face, no one blinks. You know why you're here? Uh, I guess so. You just come out from nowhere to this campus. Looking to fly. And you think you can run things, huh? She was troubling a friend of mine and all I want is for her to stop. All I want for her is to stop! Troubling her. She pays her good money and... Uh, I don't think nobody can disturb her in this car. Oh. It's money you want, huh? <laughs> Everybody loves money. Why don't you go to my car, look in the... Glove compartment, there's an envelope. <coughs> Bring it. Go get the money. Who are you and what is your mission in this campus? I am the crown prince of Mazuzu Kingdom and I'm here to look for my future bride. I guess she's Edna. Yes. <laughs> filled with interesting tales. This is for you. I don't want anyone to ever trouble Edna again. I'm buying her security and freedom. Throughout her stay on campus, I want you to watch her back. Until she leaves. You know what I mean? You can't accept this from him! You think it's that 20,000 naira you gave to me? Stop. This is real money, my prince. You have my loyalty. Can I go now? Of course you can. You're the boss. A real man can run things with you. Look at you, you double-crossing fool. You collected my money, give me back my money. Give me my money. Just give me my money. My money, give me my money back. Ah. Don't, don't. I said give I'm me my this. money. Ha! No, Just give me my money. <laughs>
Belongs to you alone. I'll come back to pick the rest of my things. Maureen. Maureen. you to my father. My prince. A good friend. That's who you are. But the question is, do I do I want to marry you? Do I? You gave a life to me, Edna. Did you have any idea what that means? You're the reason I live for now. There's nothing else. You always been my good friend. But I don't think I want to marry you. sure about that? <sighs> Very well then, I have to return to Mazuzu Kingdom at once. You deserve to get what you want, with all respect. leave you now. New presence of things in the palace, huh? Remember your highness. What is going on here? Ikoku? My beloved cousin. 
Where is my father and what are you doing on the throne? Please allow me to introduce myself. I am His Royal Highness, King Ikoku I of Masuzu Kingdom. Hmm? Now, as to your father, the late king passed away. Most unfortunately. We mourned him. And I dare say your presence was not uh, <laughs> was felt. My father is dead? Yes. Um, the throne was vacant. The land needed a leader. So naturally I stepped in. My father was healthy when I left. Yes, of course. But again, we must remind ourselves. Your father was not exactly a young man. Hmm? And death. <laughs> death, that unfathomable phenomenon. Death does not exactly announce itself when it comes knocking on our doors, does it? Hmm? I can see you are now with her. And you have changed the security code at the entrance. A minor precautionary motive. So, nothing that can long change the really meaning of the step into no power again. <laughs> Something to sit things orderly until your return. Okay. I need details of my father's death. And I am back, Ikoko. Thank you for keeping the throne in my father's absence and mine. But I'm back now to take what rightfully belongs to me. But of course. Um see uh you must be exhausted from your uh, how shall we say uh, Love quest. And I'm sure you need some measure of rest. So, I will advise you go to your quarters and rest accordingly. And then when you come back, things should have been seated properly by then. Eh? I would want to see my father's body. Send me a guard at once. God. Make sure the princess taking care of. Yes, I am. Understand? Yes, I am. What? I was merely asking them to uh, make sure that the prince is comfortable as he is accustomed to. Huh?
Your Highness, the prince is second. Mm. In that case, uh, let us aim a brief visit and see how he is doing. Eh? of Mazuzu Kingdom. What are you doing? He said he loves me. I'm here to tell him that I love him too. The prince is not around. And he will not be for a long, long time. Your Highness, if you don't mind, let me entertain her. Such an over ambitious, cold blooded animal. Plan is to marry him and marry him. I'm selling it to the woman, sorry. Ikoku, mother, the king. And now the prince is in the south. And it's only a matter of time before he orders. 
before he murders the prince. So we have to move very fast. Call this number by two this afternoon. Zero eight zero three three two two. What am I supposed to do? Okay, two 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 four four. Evening, come to the palace. You will surely meet your prince. Don't worry about I've, I've already arranged with the cook. The guard will be drugged with sleeping pills. And as for Ikoku, I will handle him myself. To make up for the prince when he was mad. Edna, you've won him. Both of you deserve to be happy, okay? Just come tomorrow, everything will be fine. God, join the others. I want to stay with my husband. Yes, us men, amongst men, strong and virile, <laughs> in all the right places, I shall have found out in many nights with you. A drink. Hello. Hello. My love, the last meeting. We talked about the market project, like we discussed. The drink. The, the drink. Yes, huh. the drink. Huh. What can you drink? What was?
happen to the gas? All of them are asleep. I gave them sleeping pills. God, I hope my head will be chopped off for this. Okay, you're working for humanity. Let me tell you more. Give me the But that's the king. He's not. He's an imposter. He murdered the king. And the prince is in the south. Go to sleep. To reward you, Amma. Prince, you don't have to. I ran out of you when I should have set you free. You were not destined to win my heart. Edna was. You were destined to restore glory to the throne. And you just did. We have a lot of work to do. We have to clean up the palace and give my father. A proper burial. What time is it? Oh, you are not you! Your head will be chopped in public. And the sight shall be beheld by the people. You've always wanted to be king. And here you are in the throne. You will die as one. Why didn't you? I don't know. But I should have killed you like I killed your father. You both rot in hell. Sound. 
Oh, oh, oh. 